What's up, everybody? I'm Logan Stones. Didn't know to hear. I'm gonna get a haircut later. It's Friday afternoon. Get ready to go home. Got a big weekend ahead. I have a book fair tomorrow at West End Public Library. And I get to meet my favorite author on Sunday, Angie Thomas. She's coming to Montgomery, and I'm going down there to see her. And hopefully, she give me some advice on being an author. So, I get ready to pack my clothes up. So, put it in the car, jump in the car, and head home. I just got done packing. I'm gonna go home. See you soon. So, I finally made it back to Birmingham. Traffic was terrible. Apparently, the road was closed, and I had to find, go through some crazy parts of Alabama to get back to Birmingham. I didn't get a haircut because it was too late, so I'm hopefully get one in the morning. Uh, yeah. Good morning. It's 6:40. About to go get a haircut and be on the way to the book fair. So I finally made it. I got my haircut. What? There's Narky. How's he doing? Narky. Anything you would like to say to the camera? Oh. Nice, that's so awesome. I don't know what YouTube name is. Okay, we have Mr. Logan Stone. 2017 graduate of Ramsey High School with my daughter, uh, Ram, and he is a junior at Troy University. And I'm telling you, this young man has a powerful testimony of you know, faith and uh, your book is called. Tell me about what the meaning of the rest of this. Okay, so Today was a successful book fair signing. Mm. I sold some books, made some good connections, networked with some people. She did her thing. Matter if you got something to say. You got you can't leave the camera without smiling. Well, had a good day, and that's it. So I got Narco, and we stopped at Milo, as you can see in the background, but they was closed inside. So we got some three-piece chicken tenders. She already grew up, and I can't show her grubbing, but I'm going to grow up, too. We finally made it. We filled in, questioning cards for her to answer. And we got a free, got a free book. Narc got a pen, and then I got like a little, we got a too. Mason, and I think everybody has their idea of what an author is what they do, what it looks like. You know, people are like, oh, you just, you sit around and write at coffee shops, don't you? <laughs> you know, inspiration strikes and you take out your feathered pen and you write. No, I'm usually sitting on my couch in my pajamas. It's very, it can be very unglamorous. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm blessed to be in the position I'm in to have had my books have the success that they have, that I've had experiences that even some of my peers have. You know, so it's it's an interesting thing because to some people I'm famous, to others no, and I'm cool with that. You know, and and it's 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 fun though for me, um, connecting with my readers in some form or fashion. I think that's the best part of being an author. So you know, writing and sitting down and writing that's that's the that's the heavy work. But when I get letters from kids who say my books. Um, open their eyes, or it's the first book they've seen themselves in, that makes it all worth it. So being an author is fun. It's a lot of travel at times, but it's, it's totally worth it when you meet those readers who love your books and connect with them on a whole different level. It's amazing. <laughs> Uh, 
so this weekend was crazy. We had a book fair Saturday. I want to thank everyone who came out and supported me and everyone who's been supporting me this whole time. You see Narco in the background. She always doing her thing. Every time we have a book fair, I couldn't do it without her. And my parents and her parents. You know. Uh, thank you for everybody who came and got a book. And, you know, everyone who already read the book, tell me what you think. Um, today I got to meet Angie Thomas, someone who I look up to. If you ain't checked out her books yet, you know. Y'all should check it out. The Hate You Give. If you ain't seen the movie, I don't know what you're missing. And then her new book, On The Come Up. She got a third book coming out. And you should check that out too. And make sure you wait ready for my second book as well.